If you are new here, please go ahead and click subscribe and click on the bell icon to get the notifications of our channel. How are we feeling? Hmm? Seems we hardly scratched the surface in our last session, so let's go a little bit deeper this time. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages, you will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Did I startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so diligently. <laughs> Cockroaches, zombies, and awful. <laughs> the sun combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> uh, well, I'm afraid once again we're out of time, but. Promise, we'll talk again very soon. Excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. 
I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. So I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh, yeah? It feels the same to me. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell phones? I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, oh, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey, gang. You guys get up here okay? <sighs> Could've done with some bellboys, but uh, hey. Can't get everything. Yeah, it was pretty easy. A little creepy, though. I mean, it's really weird being back here. Get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. So Matt and Emily are a thing now, right? Yeah, so it seems. I mean, what's Mike think of that? I have a feeling Mike's already got his hands full, you know what I mean? Huh. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like get open or something. Wait a second, are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. So, how are you doing? Good, but... A little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? And I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some snow angels, right? No. Absolutely. When are you going to take her to the bone zone? <laughs> like that could ever happen. Come on, man. She practically spends her entire life with you as it is. Well, yeah, but we're like friends. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. I don't know, man. How can you not know? But what if it's like weird? And what if she, she might not like want to be friends with me anymore if I try something like that? I mean, weren't you just listening? You gotta buck up, bro. Grow a pair. <sighs> so, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Cochise, or else you got four lovely ladies who are gonna be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh shoot, nobody likes cool buns. Damn, I'm getting pretty low in juice here. 
just gonna turn off my GPS. I'm finally like out. Side, where I might actually use it. Can you cool it on the phone talk? What? Why? It's pretty much all you talk about. Well, you know, I mean, I can do all this stuff. Well, you got an app that can get us into the lodge? Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here, use this. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what, what is it? Okay, so... I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant going to help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I got gotcha. you. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the Lormy dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye-bye, frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. 